Hello to all the head besties in the land. Today is a super exciting day because I'm doing something slightly different. We're going to do a product review and a little bit of first time reaction to this amazing new blow dryer that I hear everybody have been raving about. So it's called the Gamma Professional IQ. Um, it's it has to have a fancy name for some reason. <laughs> so you can see what it looks like. This is supposed to be extra quiet. It's supposed to be the best blow dryer, the most powerful blow dryer for hairstylists and professionals all around the world to use. Um, it says here that it's ultra light. It has a motor speed of all these numbers and seven times faster than so-and-so and extra long life, blah, 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 blah. Okay. so. A lot of times I'm just thinking, okay, is this marketing? I want to feel it, experience it for myself. I, I don't care. I just want to put it in my hands and feel the blow dryer in action, okay? Um, what really caught my attention when I saw the advertisement for this of how powerful it is, and I just saw the thin nozzle, as you can see here, that comes with it. The nozzle is the most important thing for me. Um, it's not a sponsored video. I bought this with my own money. I'll show you the receipts, okay? Let me pull out of my address here because y'all don't need to see that. Okay, but I'll show you here that I paid $369.95. And let me see what the uh, shipping was for this because that's kind of important too. Okay, shipping. Oh, did I? I guess I didn't pay for the shipping because it was free shipping. All right, well, that's a bonus. I got so excited, I literally just paid for it. Click on PayPal, boom, the payment went through. But I definitely want to show you guys my receipt here so you guys know that I spent my hard-earned money on this here. Okay, this is my email. You can see right there. I just zoom in because you guys, this, this is something so exciting. I always feel like I always want to give the most, you know, realist review on these type of situation. Last time I reviewed like that Dyson spinning curling iron thing that I spent my own money on and I feel like right now on social media everything that you see on Instagram and YouTube everything is sponsored and I was like you know what you don't know what's really more and I was like you know what I'm gonna spend my own money buy this product review it and give you guys the honest truth how I feel okay so I love the packaging the box is really really pretty so I'm just gonna open it let's open it together because I want you guys to see it with me Ugh. okay Ooh. That looks really, really nice. Look at this. Oh my god. That looks really, really nice. It's actually really small looking. The actual blow dryer itself, look how tiny this looks. See that? Look at it next to my head. It's pretty tiny. Uh, well, I like that it has a diffuser. Let me pull this out. A diffuser is important because I have a perm in my hair. So I like to diffuse my hair so all the curls can come out. Oh my god. This, this is a dream, you guys. Finally, a thin nozzle. Look how thin that nozzle is. This is great for every hair professional to get like precision blow dries. This, honestly, this is the reason why I bought it. When I saw how thin this nozzle was online, I go like, wow, this is really, really nice. Cause I like really clean stream airflow as I do a blowout. So this is definitely what um, made me want to buy it. But there's this other um, uh, concentrator here that uh, I probably won't use that one as much, I assume. This attachment is everything, the small one. All right, so let me just whip it out, pull it out. Okay, well, this is very, very, very tiny. Oh my God, look how tiny it is. Okay, guys, I, I, I just want to turn this on. Let me plug this in really quick, okay? Let's plug her in. Oh, wait, wait, hold up. I gotta, I gotta use my, my product that I created and developed, my Quick Blow Heat Protection Spray. This product is amazing. It comes out in March. So hopefully by the time I put up this video, well, it's gonna be a, a while till you guys get this product because this new hasn't come out yet. But by the time you guys see it, you probably can get it in stores. Okay, I'm just gonna spray my hair because this provides heat protection. I don't want to get it in the camera, so hold up. Got to spray it far away. Don't want to get it on the lens or anything. But it adds shine. It has heat protection. Um, 
protects the hair from heat and everything when you blow dry. God, I gotta protect my hair. It also decreased blow dry time too, and it smells like heaven. So I can't wait for you guys to try this product. Ah! Oh my god! I'm a mess. I dropped it everywhere. Oh! Okay, don't judge me. Don't judge me. I'm a little bit of a klutz. <laughs> like, it literally just slipped out of my hand. I dropped it everywhere. Are you okay? I hate when I drop my products and stuff because it puts a dent on the product. And I just want it to look pretty on the shelf. All right, you stay right there. Stop sipping out my hands, okay? All right, so I'm just going to turn it on. Hold on here. Ooh, you could peel this thing off. Isn't that cool? Nice little protection. I, I'm just gonna leave it on, okay? Because I like to keep it looking new as long as possible. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna turn her on. Whoa. Okay, so it has a very sharp sound. Doesn't bother me. It's just like a higher pitch sound. But it is definitely very powerful. Oh my god, it's lightweight. I don't understand. Okay, so I, as I turn it on, you can see that there's like... You could turn down and... Well, how do you turn it down? Oh, what did I do? Oh, that's what I did. Okay, you could turn it on right there. I don't know if you can see this. Let me do that. You could turn it on and there's a lock mode. So I accidentally put it on lock. Okay, hold on. So just put it on halfway. All right. And you can turn the temperature down. There's three temperature settings. Uh, there is three power settings. And then there's a cold shot button, which I think is cool. Let me see how quickly it turns cold, because that's really important for me. Okay, so it's very hot. So I, okay, wow. It turns cold so quick. Like right when I push it, it instantly turned cold. So it's suctioning the air from the back here. Uh, what's most important to me is, whoa, are you kidding me? I didn't even look at this until now. Look at that. That's the head of it. That's where it's blowing the air. It's blowing the air through this. What? Well, no wonder the air is so sharp. This is insane. All right, I'm a little bit impressed. Okay, hold up a second. I, I just want to compare it to my Dyson because I've been using a Dyson, so hold on a second. So this is my Dyson, and the air comes out through here. Uh, let me take that off, and the air comes out through this circle thing. You guys see that? So let's just turn this on and let's see the noise. And this is full power, as you can see. It's definitely more quiet, but hold on. You hear that? That's the Dyson. Okay, so the Dyson's more quiet. Let me check the, the weight, which one's heavier. Hmm. I don't know. You know what? I think the Dyson's heavier than this Gamma Professional IQ. Yeah, the Dyson's heavier, and it appears the cord feel it's like it's almost like the cord is heavier than the actual blow dryer itself, which is really funny. Uh, I. I've been happy with my Dyson, but let me see which concentrator is more sharp. Hold on. Okay, so this is the Gamma, and this is the, oh. So the Gamma is sharper, so that's interesting. Let me put the concentrator on the Gamma. I'll let you know exactly what's called. Gamma Professional or Gamma IQ. I'm not sure. All I know is I just want it to work good. Okay, so let's just turn it on because that can affect this the sound too. Okay, so let's do the gamma first. Okay. Hmm. Let me feel the power of the wind on my hand. Okay. Yeah, um, I have to say the force of the gamma feels more sharp and strong. So, I don't know until I use it on an actual person's head. Oh, I'm, I'm supposed to use it on my head. Ha! <laughs> okay, hold on a second. Okay. It feels really light. It's kind of weird how light it feels. Um, the air feels very sharp. 
So I feel like this would be a good blow dryer for blowouts. Okay, let me just try again with a Dyson just in comparison. I just like to compare, so. Okay, so. I don't know, it's a, it's a tough one. But I think if I have to compare, hold on, let me put the blow dryer down. Ugh. Okay, if I, if I really have to compare, I think I probably would choose the Gamma just because I like the sharpness of the nozzle. As a professional, hairstyles in a salon that works all the time and blowing out hair models and clients, I think I prefer the sharper nozzle. The, like the nozzles, the, it's one of those things where I go either I get it or I don't. Like if a blow dryer doesn't come with a sharp nozzle, I'm not going to get it. Plus I think it's important that it came with um, the diffuser as well. Let me, let me just check out the claims really quick for you guys because I feel like that's important. So let me see, any claims? This dryer's LED control facilitate the setting and reading of its 12 possible configurations. Um, actually, there's so many things. Innovative design. Um, the hair dryer is like no other. We achieved the perfect mix of extremely compact Lightweight yet powerful hair dryer is half the size of other dryers on the market. Oh my god, that's the truth. Let's talk about size. I almost forgot about that. Okay, let's compare it to like, okay, let's look at the size here. Mm, okay, so it's definitely not as girthy as the Dyson is thinner. Let me look at a regular blow dryer. Let me, I haven't used a regular blow dryer in a long time, but let me grab it just so we can compare it. Okay, so I just got a, a basic blow dryer, well I shouldn't call this basic, but it's just, you know, a, a normal size blow dryer. So let's compare the size difference because it did talk about how it's a lot more compact. Um, so I'm gonna put it side by side so you can see here. Can you guys see that? So it's definitely smaller. You can see, look, look at the size difference. Uh, it just doesn't make any sense how you can feel how heavy this is compared to this and how small this is. Uh, but the verdict, I haven't given the verdict yet, okay, because I need more proof. Okay, so it's ultra compact, we established that. It's perfectly balanced, ergonomic, compact dimensions, and it's lightweight. Digital control interface, which increases the hair dryer's performance and the motor's use life cycle. Digital, digital, digital. Digital what? Digital control interface. Okay, whatever that means, because I don't see any digital stuff on here. So, huh. Oh, I see. Like when you push on the thing, it's not like a switch. It's just kind of like, it's digital, I suppose. It's ultra lightweight. Yes, it is. That I agree with. Three meters? Long cord. Meters? Is it meters? 3M. I don't know. I'm horrible at math. You know, I... I like failed at math in school. I'm like the worst. Uh, me and numbers don't go together. Okay, temperature sen sensor, uh, LED indicators, um, the dryer's LED control for, oh, the LED, okay, so that means like it lights up to let you know. So I guess that's, so I guess that's the LED. Um, it has fa seven times faster than traditional hair dryers with the motor speed. Speed, temperature setting, three speed, three temperature and cool shot. Life motor, lightweight, powerful, long lasting, oxy active technology. It emits active oxygen that acts like a powerful antibacterial. Back antibacterial, so it kills bacteria as it blow dries your hair? Well, that's cool. Okay, auto clean technology that makes the motor turbine speed or spin in the opposite direction, deep cleaning the filter. So you don't have to take the thing out so it cleans itself. Oh, are they sure about that? That, that always makes me nervous. Okay, because I hate when like dust gets trapped inside of the motor. Um, special air outlet designed to multiply the airflow. Okay. Whatever. Let me just blow dry my hair with it. Let me see if you can... No, you can't take the back out. Can you? So I guess you never have to take the back out? So dust doesn't get inside of it? 
I guess I, I will never know until we own this blow dryer for years to come and see what happens. All right, let's see, where is it made in? Um, it doesn't say, oh, made in PRC. That's why it says made in PRC. All right, here we go. Blow dry, blow dry time. Let's see how quick it blow dries my hair. After all that talking I did, my hair is like almost dry anyways, but actually, okay, so I really love it. Um, let me get a round brush, because that's one way to tell. Okay. It's so hard to round brush your hair. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm just used to round brushing everyone else's hair but my own. So this is a situation. It's always a struggle to do your own hair, right? It's hard to curl it. Style it. Okay. All right, look at that volume. Okay, first of all, I have to say I do like it. Um, I'm gonna use it on a regular client's hair or a model's hair and see how I feel about it first. But so far, first impression, I really, really do like it. Um, let me try the diffuser really quick. I, I don't know if you guys like this type of video, but I feel like this is something I just wanna, I just wanna do something fun and, and try new, you know, hair toys. Huh. Wow. Okay, I have to say, I'm a little bit more impressed with this diffuser than the Dyson, and let me tell you why. Let me compare it, okay? Let me compare the Dyson. Hold on. Let me get the Dyson. Okay. You know what? I hate comparing things because I feel like it's really your taste. Like everyone has different hands and bodies and shapes, so whatever feels more comfortable to you, you know? But let's just compare. Okay, let me try this one. Just to feel the heat. Hmm. Well, they're both very similar, to be honest. I can't really tell much of a difference. All right, well, that's the answer to that. Okay, I don't know if you guys like like these um, like candy as much as I do, but it's called it's sugar, and this is my favorite candy. It's called strawberry puffs. Oh, it tastes so good. Oh, mm. I also got I also got the blueberry one too. And that's really good. I'm like a candy whore. So yeah, I always gotta have candy around me. This is one of my favorites because I love nerds. What am I doing? What am I talking about? Never mind. I just like candy. Okay, let me just finish blow dry my hair. All right, let's put this down. Well, I hope you guys like this type of video, product review, because if you do like it, <clears throat> I'm gonna do more for you. And if you like it, leave some comments below. Tell me what you think. Um, it's your choice. If you wanna get the blow dryer, get it. I personally like it so far. We'll just see how long it lasts. If you like it, I could do more videos for you guys because I have a few other products I want to buy and try out. But I just wanted to try it with you guys because I think it's fun. Because <laughs> I feel like we're opening like a special box of surprise together. And you get to know it here first on my channel. All right. Well, most of my hair is dry. All right, so I do like it. Tell me what you guys think. Do you guys like the design, the shape, the sound, the nozzle, the technology? I like it. Uh, I can't wait to use it on a client. I'm gonna use it tomorrow on a client, which makes me super, super excited. And before I let you guys go, make sure you subscribe, hit that bell for all the notification. And I just released my new album. Hashtag more to me my single quit on this and tell me is over is out till I found you I'm so excited. I worked so hard on my music and my album. I've, I've been recording for over seven months I've written co-written even co-produced some of the tracks. So I'm super excited about it It tells my story. So if you guys want to check it out on Spotify iTunes Make sure you download and stream my songs. So before I I say bye. I'm going to leave you guys out with this amazing intro of a snippet of my music video. 
Quit on this. We'll just do like a quick 30 second snippet of quit on this music video. Hit it! Dragging you through the mud, what was I thinking? 